Let's dive into some education news. Due to the pandemic, many graduations were virtual last year, including Central Georgia Tech's. They were supposed to hold another virtual graduation ceremony this year. But when Governor Kemp loosened restrictions for outdoor gatherings, they decided to celebrate face to face. Taylor Hicks talked with a 2021 graduate about her big day. Last Friday, Shemitria Risper graduated from Westside High School. This Friday, she'll receive her associate's degree from Central Georgia Technical College. It hasn't really like hit me yet that I was able to get a degree and a diploma at 18 years old. Like it just still hasn't really soaked, soaked in all the way yet. Since the summer of ninth grade, Shemitria has been taking dual enrollment classes at Central Georgia Tech, making it possible for her to receive a degree in general studies. I just feel really, really blessed and really much proud of myself. And she did it all during a pandemic. It's not always the easiest thing, especially in going in 10th grade with balancing AP classes and trying to do dual enrollment classes. It got really, really hard. But she says she kept her eyes on the prize. Until a few weeks ago, Shemitria did not think that she would graduate in person from Central Georgia Tech. But now she and hundreds of other college graduates can walk across the stage on Friday. Now that it's an in-person graduation, it feels really special knowing that with being virtual, you know, it doesn't hit the same as having an in-person graduation and being able to really soak in those feelings of, you know, walking across that stage. Originally, uh, we're doing a virtual based on all the restrictions. Craig Jackson, Vice President of Student Affairs, says because of Governor Brian Kemp's executive order on outdoor events, Central Georgia Tech will hold graduation in person. We were able to uh, work with the city of uh, Macon to uh, secure Henderson Stadium and actually have a face-to-face -face graduation, so we're excited. Jackson says masks are not required but encouraged, and they ask all students to limit their number of guests to four. Reporting in Macon, Taylor Hicks, 13 WMAZ News. And if you're planning on attending Central Georgia Tech's graduation tomorrow, 9 a.m., and as you heard, it's at Henderson Stadium.